Imagine this, XRP skyrocketing past $5, then $10, and you're standing on the sidelines, watching it unfold. Now, you might be wondering, could this really happen? And if so, when should you get in? Should you buy in now, while it's hovering around 52 cents, or wait until it's on the rise and seemingly more proven at $5 or $10? That's exactly what we're breaking down in today's episode. Whether you're a seasoned crypto enthusiast or just getting started, today's analysis could reshape the way you think about investing in XRP. This is a video you do not want to miss. Hello, fellas watching from around the world, welcome back to another exciting episode of the Zaki Crypto Update channel, your number one crypto plug. Whether you're here for the latest updates on your favorite tokens, predictions on the next big moves, or in-depth analysis, you're in the right place. If you're new to the channel, make sure to smash that subscribe button and turn on notifications because today's episode is packed with crucial insights that could help you make smarter decisions in the crypto space. We're diving into a critical discussion on XRP, a coin that has remained under $1 for years, and why some experts think people won't jump in until it hits $5 or even $10. So, here's what we're going to cover, we'll break down why some market commentators believe most people are waiting for XRP to reach higher prices before investing. Then, we'll explore whether this strategy could actually cost you big gains. We'll also look at different expert opinions about XRP's potential, including the possibility of it surpassing $5, $10, or even higher. But there are some surprising risks to consider too, so stick around to get the full picture. By the end of this video, you'll have the clarity you need to decide whether you should invest now or wait. Trust me, you don't want to miss this. Let's start with an uncomfortable truth about investing, particularly in cryptocurrency. It's something that even the most experienced investors wrestle with timing. You've probably heard the phrase buy low, sell high countless times. Simple, right? But here's the catch, most people do the opposite. They buy high and sell low, and this is especially true when fear or excitement clouds their judgment. Now, let's bring XRP into the equation. For the past few years, XRP has remained under $1. At the time of this recording, it's trading around 52 cents. For those of us already invested, this could be viewed as a golden opportunity. After all, buying at such a low price could mean massive returns if the coin takes off, right? However, according to Blessed, a popular crypto commentator, most people won't buy XRP until it's already more expensive, until it reaches $5 or $10. Why? Because the average investor tends to wait for confirmation that an asset is on the rise before they jump in. It's what we call FOMO, the fear of missing out. Many people are more comfortable buying in when a coin is climbing because they see it as safe. But by waiting for that confirmation, they might be giving up the biggest potential gains. At its current price of about $0.529, if XRP were to climb to $5, that would represent a massive 845% return on investment. And if it hit $10? We're talking about a 1,790% increase. But if you wait until it's already at $5 or $10, you've missed out on the early, most lucrative stage of the growth. Sure, you could still make some money, but the upside is nowhere near as substantial. Think of it this way, would you rather buy Bitcoin when it was at $100 or wait until it hit $10,000? The same principle applies here with XRP. But there's another side to this coin, pun intended. History has shown that entering the market during periods of heightened enthusiasm often puts investors at greater risk. The perfect example? Look at what happened back in 2018. XRP hit an all-time high of around $3, and people rushed to buy in. Six years later, those who bought at that peak are still down over 80%. That's the danger of buying into the hype rather than seizing opportunities when prices are low and sentiment is lukewarm. Some say yes, and some say no. Let's first consider the optimistic viewpoint. According to certain analysts within the XRP community, even a price point of $5 to $10 is conservative. They argue that XRP's true value is much higher and that those who wait until it reaches these levels could still see a significant upside. For instance, one notable commentator believes that in a few years, $10 could seem like a bargain as XRP continues to rise, perhaps even reaching $20 or more. These experts point to XRP's role in the global financial ecosystem, particularly its use in cross-border payments, as a major factor that could drive its price higher in the long term. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. Not everyone is so bullish on XRP's future. Some analysts are far more cautious, if not downright skeptical. 
Take market psychologist Michael XBT, for example. He predicts that XRP's peak value in this cycle will be no higher than $2. According to him, forecasts of XRP surging to $5 or $10 are wildly unrealistic and, as he puts it, delusional. Michael XBT goes further to warn that those who wait for these higher price points risk becoming exit liquidity for more seasoned investors. In other words, while you're waiting for XRP to hit $5 or $10, those who got in early might already be cashing out, leaving you holding the bag with minimal gains or worse, losses. This brings us to a critical question, should you wait for XRP to hit $5 or $10, or should you buy now? Let's look at the facts. XRP is not a new player in the crypto space. It's been around for nearly a decade, and it has a clear use case serving as a bridge currency for cross-border payments. Ripple, the company behind XRP, has been steadily building partnerships with major financial institutions worldwide. More importantly, Ripple's ongoing legal battle with the SEC, which has been a dark cloud over XRP for years, is now drawing to a close. A positive outcome could act as a major catalyst for XRP's price, potentially sending it to new all-time highs. But here's where things get tricky. Even with all this positive momentum, investing in XRP or any cryptocurrency, for that matter, comes with risks. The market is incredibly volatile, and sentiment can change in the blink of an eye. While XRP's fundamentals are strong, no one can predict the future with certainty. For those considering entering at $5 or $10, remember this, by the time XRP reaches those levels, you're no longer at the ground floor. You're joining the party midway, which means the potential for massive gains has likely diminished. Yes, you could still make some money, but the risk-to-reward ratio is far less attractive than it is at 52 cents. And yet, some will wait. Some will feel safer buying in at higher prices because it seems like a more confirmed move. But the question is, will that confirmation come at the cost of missing out on the biggest potential gains? If you're finding this content valuable and want more deep dive analyzes like this, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. We've got more insightful content on the way, and you'll want to stay informed. So hit that notification bell too, and be the first to know when new videos drop. To wrap things up, the decision to buy XRP at 52 cents or wait until it hits $5 or $10 is ultimately a personal one. It comes down to your risk tolerance, your belief in XRP's long-term potential, and how comfortable you are with the volatility of the crypto market. Some experts say waiting until XRP reaches $5 or $10 could cost you the biggest gains, while others believe those price levels still offer plenty of upside. The important thing is to make an informed decision that aligns with your own investment strategy. As always, remember that we are not financial advisors, and you should do your own research before making any financial decisions. Crypto is a high-risk, high-reward market, and it's essential to manage your expectations and only invest what you can afford to lose. Thank you for sticking around to the end of the video. If you found this content helpful, please like, share, and subscribe to support the channel. We've got more in-depth analysis and breaking crypto news coming your way, so make sure to check out some of my other videos to stay ahead of the curve. Until next time, stay informed, stay sharp, and as always, keep hustling in the crypto space.